In this video, I will show you how to download and install Crazy Craft 4. I must emphasize that to do this, you must have the paid version of Minecraft. For this installation, we will need to close Minecraft and jump over to our browser. Now, after we have jumped over to our browser, you will need to select one of the search boxes and write Void Wrath. Then press the Enter button, and when you get here, you open up the first link at the top. Then, when you get inside of the website, you will need to go over to the Play Free Now button. You select that, then you need to scroll down. Here you have some of the description about the launcher, you have the launcher requirements, and then you have the Windows slash Mac requirements. Make sure that you fit all of these requirements and make sure that you have the latest Java version installed. To install, you just open up a new tab and press the search box and you write java.com. Then you press the enter button, you go over to the Java website, you press the download Java button, and after you have downloaded Java, you will need to run the Java installer and follow the installation instructions displayed on the screen. The whole setup process should be pretty simple. Now let's go back to the void launcher, we can close the Java tab, and to launch the installation, you will need to hit one of these buttons, I will press download for Windows. Also, you need to note that you should be able to run vanilla Minecraft on at least 60 FPS to be able to have a good experience with this launcher and the mod packs that come alongside it. After the download has been finished, you will need to close your browser. Let's wait for our to finish, it just did, let's close our browser, then open up File Explorer, go over to Downloads, and you can drag the file that you just downloaded to your desktop. Let's close this. Double left click the file that we just downloaded and then we press the extract all button. We select where the location of the file that we are extracting or where we want it to be and we press the extract button. After we have finished the extraction we can close both of these and here we have the new folder that we just extracted. We double left click and open it up. Then we select the void launcher option right here and we double left click and open it up. Now, right here at the bottom, you will need to log in with your Microsoft or Mojang account. You press the login button and in here enter your Microsoft account. See, I just did. You will need to press the search button right here and in there you will need to write crazy. Then at the top you will see CrazyCraft 4. Here you can see the mod list and then you press the play button. After you press the play button, a download will start. And now, after we have pressed the play button, as you can see, it's already starting. CrazyCraft 4 is played on Minecraft 1.7.10, so you can't change the version. Now that Minecraft has loaded, we press the single player option at the top, we press create a new world, let's create a creative world, and let's press create new world. And now we are back inside of Minecraft, as you can see in the bottom left, we have the list of mods that we have inside of Minecraft running right now. Let's open up our inventory, and here we can see everything that we have, and that this mod offers. It's pretty awesome, to be honest. That is it for this video, thank you for watching, see you in the next one.